So hey guys, this is Vishwith and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can delete folders using Python. So I'll come back to my screen. So here you can see I have shown you my working directory currently where I am actually. And this is the Jupyter Notebook file that I'm working on, which I have opened it in Firefox. Now I'll, sh I'll create a directory and I'll show you how to delete the directory. So uh, in the previous videos, I have shown you how to create directory. It's pretty simple. Import OS, OS, OS dot. Uh, so there are two commands, like two functions you can use to create directories. So you can use M, uh, mkdir and also you can use makedirs, both does the same thing. Uh, so let's use mkdir because I have shown uh, make directories, make dirs in the previous video. In this video, I will show you this function mkdir. So let's create a folder. Let's name it as cities. Okay. Now if I execute this, okay. Now we, are, we see cities got created. Now if I want to delete this folder, it's pretty simple os dot. Now here you can see there are two commands. You can use uh, remove dirs or you can use rmdir. Both does the same thing. You, we can use this or we can use this. So if I do cities and if I do shift enter, this got deleted. So pretty, pretty simple. Now I will show you how to delete a folder if it contains files inside of them. So let me get some data. I have created some data over here. I'll paste it over here. So inside cities, you can see there is a folder called as photos and inside this photos, I have two photo. Now, how you can delete these two photos? So uh, we have to get inside cities. We have to get inside photos. Let, let, let's show, let's, let's see that how, what happens if you try to delete these cities. Okay. So I'm going to clean up os.rm dir and cities always at rmdir cities and if i do shift enter it is saying the directory is not empty because cities inside cities there are uh, another another folder is there and inside that folder we have different files so how to check how like what are the files or folders that represent inside cities that also i have said you in the previous video we can use os dot list dir and we can pass the cities the folder name that for which we want to check the files and the folders. And if we do shift enter, so inside cities, we have something called as photos. Okay, great. Now we have to get inside photos. Now how we can do that? So we can obviously do something like this cities slash photos. Okay. And if we do shift enter, we can see there are two files. Okay. How we know there are two files because the ex extension is provided. Okay. Now we can delete these two particular files and then we can uh, delete photos and then we can delete cities. Okay. So how we can do that. And one, and one more thing, I have passed the path in this format. Okay. Even this works and I'll show you other thing OS dot let me get it in a different variable. If I take path equal to os dot path dot join. And if I give cities and inside cities, we had the folder called as photos. And if we pass this path inside, we should get the same output. And if I do shift enter, and you can see we are getting the same output. Okay. So both works in the same way. It's better to use the os.part.join because if you are working on Linux, it will change based upon your like, it will change, it will give front slash instead of backslash. Okay, so minute, minute things are there. I have already explained this in my previous video. So we have two files present. Now, if we want to delete these two files, how we can do that? So generally, I can save this list L equal to this and my L contains all of these elements. Now, what I can do for I in 
l os dot we need to remove file so it is remove and i need to pass the file path okay which is os dot which is path and i have to give comma and i have to give i okay so if i do this what happens shift enter okay remove takes exactly one positional argument but two were given okay i'm sorry i have to give like this os dot path dot join okay i'll show you what this actually prints uh let me print only this part so that you get a clear idea what we are trying to do we are trying to delete these two files inside cities inside photos we are trying to delete these two files okay so i'll print it p r i n t and i'll show you this okay so you can see we are getting a proper directory naming convention okay so inside cities we have photos and in, we have the night.jpg we have different files and we also have the starfish file now i will just pass this path directly to my remove uh, function and it will delete them so now if i pass this whole thing inside my remove and if i do shift enter it should be able to delete and see it deleted it now we need to come one step back okay and we need to uh delete the fo uh, photos folder os dot rmdir inside path i just need to give this path and it should be able to delete it hopefully you remember what path is path is cities and photos okay if i do shift enter it deleted photos now like that we can delete cities also are always or rmdir i have to give this as a string if i do shift enter it deleted cities also so this is how you can delete uh, files and folders okay like there is other way of doing it but i i feel there is a different module which will help you to do this in one step i am going to show you about that model in the upcoming video hope this video was little bit helpful for you and if it was do press that like button and as always thank you for watching i am going to see you in an upcoming video